This is a biomedical company that helps to supply implants for knee replacement surgery. How can I draw the surface of the knee into the implant device? Usually, we need to redraw the surface of the knee using a reverse engineering techniques, which might take some time. Eh? PDS can help you. Let me show you how you can use NX to fasten the process by using convergence modeling technology. First of all, let us have a look into the knee geometry. So, as it is currently shown, the knee geometry is a facet body. Convergence modeling technologies allow us to combine facet data with parametric data. Therefore, we are going to convert the facet body into a convergent body. Next, we are going to proceed to the implant geometry as such and perform a subtract operation. So as for the target, we are going to choose the implant, the tools, we are going to choose the convergent body. Click OK and we are getting the end result with the imprint of the knee. Yes, this is the solution that I'm looking for. But how can I modify the position of the holes? BTS can help you. Sure. You can use synchronous technologies to modify. Let me show you on this. From the part history tree, we are going to temporarily suppress the previously subtract operation so that we are back to the parametric data. And we are going to use the synchronous modeling command move phase to quickly select the geometry and reposition the holes. Select the vector, drag the arrow, reposition according to the distance value. OK, uh, rearrange the history tree, and finally unsuppress the subtraction operation, and hence, we are able to do it as quickly as such. Wow, there are so many useful features that can ease my work, but will that be costly? Don't worry, now we have commercial day promotion. You may contact our DTS sales team for more information or to make a customized request during this special promotion day. Hurry up before this deal ends on September 15th. Looking forward to meet you!